see in the place to be and the sea for the players yeah hi all and welcome back to my channel i hope you guys are all fine <laughs> yeah um i got here something to show because i really love it and in the first place i want just to say thank you Abelnut because you made here real great custom firmware i just love it you know, so I was the guy before with Reebok and all the stuff, <laughs> long, long time ago, also with Rogero. But I need to say one thing, Abelnet, you have done here a damn great job, really. I love this custom firmware and that's why I have just tested around. I'm really pretty happy with it. Uh, I found no issues at all and it just works fine. I got here one of my lovely PlayStation 3 Fat Edition. Um, this one here is just cool as hell. <laughs> Cool as hell, huh? And a C. <laughs> yeah, but uh, like I told, this one here is one of my favorite ones. This here is just one so cool. I have done uh, lots of modifications here. I got here also a Raptor inside. Yeah, really great HDD, which is really just fast like hell. <laughs> All is just like hell on this console here. But here, I'm right now on the way to install the yeah custom firmware for. Dot eight eight dot two from Abelnut and this custom firmware is one of my favorites right now because it has so many features and I just want to yeah show that the people the people need to know about that and that's why I was here on the way to install it now on my lovely PlayStation 3 Fat Edition and uh, normally this one <laughs> was just by the side because I really just don't want to use it a lot of times because this one here is just unique here. Even that. <laughs> You're welcome. And um, yeah, I have tested a lot also for this guy, and he just does really great stuff. And um, yeah, I just love it, really, guys. And that's why I'm gonna just begin. I'm gonna not lose so much time. Uh, the first thing <laughs> that I need to show you is, of course, just move here to the network symbol here. Yeah, just go here. I'm gonna not just disable the lights, maybe. But wait, let me just make the other lights on. Here we go, and now I can just disable these lights, and I just need you to show you some great stuff about there. So here, it's already beginning to turn the fan higher because I got here all just automatically. So here, the temperatures are just great. So let me not just show you the temperatures <laughs> on the fat <laughs> on the fat edition, <laughs> 58 and 50 degrees. This is just <laughs> this is just so cool. This PlayStation Fat Edition here. This is an um, yeah. Yeah, backwards compatibly, but this one is so damn cool. You can see that on the CPU it's just about on 59 degrees and on the RSX it has just 50 degrees. So this ones, you need to know, they are normally running way, way hot <laughs> and way hotter, let's say like that. So, But this one here with the air cooling is just so cool. I love it. Yeah, the thing that I just wanted to show you is here inside, okay? So maybe some people just doesn't know that and that's why I just want to show you that, guys, Go over here to network and go all the way up, okay? Here you're gonna find now a folder which, yeah, just calls custom firmware tools, okay? Just get there inside. Then you got here some great, yeah, power options like turn it off, hard reboot, soft reboot, or here LV2 reboot. So here, then you just go back, you go here now to basic tools. Let's go here inside. <laughs> you can do here now so many things, okay? Fan speed. Let's uh, let's just check it out. I'm here on 31%, and here you can just check your fan speed. So here, check it again because now it just gets down to 20%. Okay. So this is just the style how I have just set it on. Yeah, Batman mod because you can also set your fan configurations. You can just configure that all, of course, with Batman mod. But if you just don't have Batman mod, then you can just use a custom firmware like this one here. Because this custom firmware has just all included. <laughs> yeah, so great, this guy. Um, I really love you, man. No homo. <laughs> but um, you've done really a great job. So let's go here. Temperature. You can see the temperature now. CPU and RSX. 59 CPU, uh, 56 on the RSX. And then you can also uh, yeah, just set some stuff like show IDPS or show PSID and all the stuff. So let's move down again once more. Cobra tools, wow, yeah, oh yeah, <laughs> okay, fan tools, let's go, you can now here just, yeah, select some stuff, manual speed, dynamic fan control, I love it, man, I love it, I love it, 
<laughs> yeah, Donald Duck loves it too, yeah? <laughs> All right, so here you can see now, this is really for the players. Yeah, man, I'm not kidding. You can here just set your PlayStation on 60 degrees, 65, 70 or 75 degrees, okay? But you need also to, uh, to, uh, to, you need also to know one thing. Do not set here anything and then set it, of course, also on Webman mod. This code makes some problems because if you have already set some stuff with Webman mod, so please do not set here anything because this is some kind of mishmash and maybe you could have some problems if you just try to start Multiman, okay? So here, if you just try to start Multiman, it can happen that Multiman will not start because here something is just going on in the background and that's why it's not recommended to, yeah, let's say, activate here some stuff and activate it also on Webman mod, okay? Because there yeah, are some kind of... Uh, nearly the same settings, so um, yeah, it's the same thing, they are working on the background always, you need to know that, so if you just set here some stuff, this is always working in the background, okay? So, now let's just go on here, manual speed, you can set it here as to manual, and like I told, let's go back to dynamic fan control, you can tell the PlayStation, you don't know, uh, you know what, uh, I just don't want that you go higher than 70 degrees, okay, you can just set it, or let's say for the freaky people, I just don't want that the PlayStation gets higher than 60 degrees. You can just set it here and this will control it all automatically, okay? You're gonna love this, guys. So, if you are more the silent guy, <laughs> yeah, then you just set it on 75 because, yeah, it will cool it down. 75 is so, let's say, some kind of limit of the PlayStation, which is still no problem from the temperatures because, yeah, the problem gets, let's say, it begins on about 80, 85 degrees, okay? So here, 70 and 75 degrees is still all okay. If you have a great PlayStation just like I have, you can also set it here without problems on 70 degrees. I can just recommend that because 70 degrees is not that big deal, okay? So here, now, like I told, fan speed. You can also here set the uh, fan speed for some kind of PlayStation 2 games. So if you just want to play PlayStation 2 games, the PlayStation 3 is going to notice that and then it's going to turn the fan even higher. This is normally just made for the, let's say, uh, CECH A and B versions, let's say for the yeah, USA or Japanese consoles because they uh, have an extra, uh, you know that, that they, they have an extra chip, so they have an extra, yeah, let's say, hardware processor chip. Uh, which of course allows you to play PlayStation 2 games even better, okay? So, but yeah, for this PlayStation, this here is really great because now you can just go here inside and then you can, let's say, yeah, let's say you start a PlayStation 2 game, it's gonna notice and it will, it will just directly start the fan to 60%, okay? So it's just up to you, you can just set it like you want. It's really nice here, control fan mode. <laughs> so, so many things, I really love it. QA tools, <laughs> which I always love to use. And here, lots of more stuff, guys. Check this out, okay? Dumb tools, here we go. Wow, 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 yeah? Take a look, guys, get inside. Service tools, wow, 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 wow. <laughs> okay, this is just great, man, okay? And that's why I just wanted to show you this. Get here inside, Cobra tools, and um, yeah, you can also here, skip the, uh, the license creation and uh, it's just great guys really I, I don't know what to say um it's just really great um i'm so damn happy with this custom firmware it's also stable and i don't know uh, what to say else because um, i'm really happy and here you can really do a lot of stuff okay so yeah guys um if you like just support evilnet um because he's a good guy and we need peoples like him because, you know, this is the PlayStation 3 life. The PlayStation 3 is just great with the custom firmware, okay? <laughs> Otherwise, the PlayStation 3 is just boring, okay? So, yeah, that's I want to talk, uh, That's what I wanted just to show you. Um, I really love it. You can here do some stuff. Here, this is also a great thing. Toggle between custom and original, yeah? That, that's great. So, yeah, here. It's just great. Toggle system version. You can here between custom and original system version. You don't need to panic here. You're gonna not be able to do something wrong. You can <laughs> you can go here inside, just shut it off, just do restart and all gonna be like it was just before. And yeah, I am pretty sure I have forgot about lots of more features and settings and configurations. But uh, that's why I just say 
install this custom firmware guys because you're gonna love it and here you're gonna find lots of information, you're gonna find lots of features, you're gonna find lots of things that you maybe never saw before, <laughs> just like myself, because here this is just great. You can go here just inside easily without problem and then you can just set the most stuff, okay? You can set your IDs, you can set so many stuff and that's why I love it, okay? So yeah, I just wanted to hold you up to date with this yeah, lovely custom firmware. Um, for now, I have nothing more to say. This is my lovely PlayStation, like I told, with a <laughs> Raptor S, yeah, with a Raptor HD inside, with 10,000 rounds per minute, <laughs> turning like hell. The games are loading nearly so fast, like an SSD, sometimes faster. I have showed this, yeah, already on some older videos. And yeah, this is the way you can go. Uh, lovely custom firmware, 4.88. Uh, really, guys. Uh, yeah, I think I have nothing more to say. I just wanted to show you that because this is just so great, okay? Get you inside, like I told, and check that out. <laughs> turn off the PlayStation 3, beep, and now it's gonna just turn off. Okay, guys, um, this was all for me. NSC is the place to be, hee <laughs> hee. Yeah, <laughs> wish you the best. Guys, really, promise, um, you need to trust me. When I, sh uh, yeah, when I just show you something, then I got a big reason for And this is my lovely PlayStation 3. Uh, let me just show you this because some guys, they always need some proofs. But I'm going to show you that, that I have just installed this one on my lovely PlayStation 3 Fat Edition. You can see that also here. <laughs> Ta -ta, what we have here? Yeah. Our oh, nice extra fan for the yeah, power supply. And what we got here? Wow. <laughs> A monster cooling. Yeah. Yeah, guys. Again, like I told, just trust me. And... Uh, you please, um, you know, you need to know one thing. If it comes to PlayStation 3, I just love these babies here, <laughs> you know, and I just try to keep that alive so long as I can. And guys, this is the way you can go, man. Really, I'm not just doing here some publics for Evil Nut because, uh, of course, I just also like to do some publics for Evil Nut. Don't understand me wrong because this guy is really working hard on this custom filmers, okay? And so, please, guys. Subscribe to him also and uh, support this guy. Uh, give him some donations, I don't know. But uh, yeah, man, just like um, PS3 exploit, you know. So I have also yesterday sent some money <laughs> because I like to support these people and I have no problem with that. So I just sent them some money over PayPal without problem. I just make it click and here, you're welcome. <laughs> okay, really, because these guys, these people, they just deserve it. They are just people like me. And we deserve it, really, because we are working hard on that stuff, okay? Hey, okay, I think I have nothing more to say. This is the way to go for the players. <laughs> oh, yeah, for the players. <laughs> okay, guys, I wish you the best. That was all for me. I wish you a nice weekend. And, yeah, let's just stay tuned here on my channel. Subscribe if you have not. Thumbs up and leave me a comment. Yeah, peace. Yeah, what's up? NC. Hey, <laughs> In the place to be. <laughs> NC. <laughs> <laughs>